Democratic primaries and caucuses. So, please, welcome to the stage, Senator Elizabeth Warren. Students? Let's go right to it. In case it. I want closer. All right. <laughs> you have to keep an eye on the ones in the back. I want to start, okay. I want to start with your big announcement today about yes. college affordability. It obviously could impact a lot of the students here. For that, I want to bring in uh, Dina Miller, who's from Massachusetts. She's a junior at St. Elsom College studying history. Dina? Hi, Dina. Hi, Senator. I, like so many other students, had to take out loans to pay for my education yep. that I will be paying off for years. What is your plan to deal with student debt and the rising cost of education? Okay, thanks for the question, Dina. You know, this is the America we live in now. Uh, basically, to get a shot at a middle-class life, you've got to have some post-high school technical training, two-year college, four-year college, maybe graduate school, depending on who you are and what you're ending up doing. The position of the federal government has been good luck to you. You're on your own. The one thing they've done is they've lent tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, millions, billions of dollars to our students. And it is now crushing them. So my proposal is to say this isn't right. What we have to do as a country is roll back that debt. And so I have two parts to the proposal. Part one is that we say uh, that we are going to roll back student loan debt for about 95% of students who have debt. That's part one. And part two is to make sure that we never get in this mess again on student loan debt, and that is to make college universally available with free tuition and fees, and to put more money into Pell Grants so that students of color, so that our poorest students have real access to college, and that we put some real money into our historically black colleges and universities. This is about opportunity for everyone. And can we talk about how